Hey guys, Axionerve here, and uh, like I said before, it, we're going to do a tutorial on this town hall, and that's what this video is going to be. But instead of a regular tutorial, this is going to be more of an in-depth tutorial. I guess you could call it that. Um, but it, you'll see what I'm talking about in a bit. First things first, though, I am using the John Smith texture pack for this because uh, Doku Craft has some weird crap going on with it. I don't know why. Yeah, it's weird shadows and it's really dark and the torches are doing some weird shit. So we're going to use um, John Smith for now. Second of all, the flags, uh, I had to change those a bit because they uh, had X's on these. So it <laughs> looked good on a flag. Anyway, I made some changes. Uh, on the inside, I changed this uh, big hall room up into um, more of a town hall and less of a church. So yeah. Woo. Okay. Come back outside. Okay. I have this huge area ready. Come on, there we go. Uh, ready for us to build on. And I put down a block. This is going to be our corner block right here. So, this is where we're going to start. And uh, I'll give you one little look around the place. This is going to be extended, like I said before. I mean, extended, what, four blocks, I think, in this way. So, it's a little bit more even once we get to that point in the tutorial. But I think, uh, yeah, that's about it. So let's get started. We'll come over here to our tree block. Okay. Now, this room, this little front piece, which is right over here, and the one next to it, which is around, well, somewhere around this area, they're both going to be the exact same, and they're pretty darn small. They're just a 5x5 uh, five five room. So not, not really big, but yeah, it's just a tree block, and you count three spaces, and put another tree block. Middle is just going to be a stone brick on the bottom. I'm just going to do like a basic outline of the building first. So we'll just count another three and put another tree block. Another tree block. Stone bricks. Like so. Okay. And that's pretty much the basis of this building right here. It's just tiny, tiny, tiny. Are those? Stone yes, okay, cool. Just making sure they look kind of mossy or something. Anyway, once we get to this area though, we're going to throw in a tower. And it's not too difficult to do, it's not too different, but we're going to go a diagonal right here and right here. And the walls in this are, are going to be three blocks as well. So we'll just count three, put another diagonal, three, and a diagonal, this should be three, yes. Okay, now the reason we're making it a diagonal block is as you can tell, right here, this bottom level, uh, it goes in one block to the next level, and that goes in one block to the next level. So we making it a diagonal, so when it comes up to here, it'll look okay, and here it doesn't look tiny tiny, so Yeah. Pretty much pretty much just you no know, spreading it out a bit. I don't know. I don't, <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Anyway. Uh to get to the next side over there. Well actually first let me. Two, three, two, three. Okay. Over there, <laughs> we're gonna need to start with this block. This is a wood block right here, and we're gonna count 11 blocks that way. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, shaboom. And that's gonna be uh, the next tower, and this is three blocks for this room. That one. Boom. It's pretty much the exact same as on that side, so. Uh, Nothing too crazy. There we go. And we'll put in our stone bricks. Get out of my way, piggy. I'm doing some some stuff here. Okay, now. This front part is going to be slightly different. We're just going to have... Uh, we're going to divide it into three sections, right? We're going to have uh, one little section right here, another one right here, and then the one in the middle with the door. Now, we... The reason we're starting it from right here is because we're going to count one, two, three, then put a log block, three, another log block, and that should be three as well. And that'll pretty much allow us to have this interior space be a bit bigger than just three blocks. You dig? You dig, homie? Put stone bricks on the bottom right here, as well right here, and then right here we're going to save for when we do the uh, door way part thing. Anyway, for the back part, uh, it's pretty simple. We're just going to put another block right here. Another one right here. So we'll have this little 
triangular shape, I guess, of uh, log blocks in this little area. Anyway, we're going to count, uh, what, uh, how many windows do we have over here now? Three? Okay, we're gonna make four windows. So, we need to count three, and a log block. Whoops, whoa, whoa, damn flower, god dang it, okay. Three, then another log block. So that's two, two sections, which equals two windows. Another one, and finally, another one. So that should be four. Okay. And we're just going to repeat the same thing on this side. So, yeah. Flowers are getting in my way. I really don't understand why you can't place a block down and get rid of the flowers like you can with grass. It's kind of annoying. Anyway, for the inside of this, we're basically just going to repeat the same thing as it's on this side. So we're going to come right around here and do that and then fill in this space with these so that is what we look like for the outline so far and then for that side blah, for that side we're just going to make this little rounded piece which is going to be stone bricks I'm not peeking at it I know what it is <laughs> okay so Two diagonal blocks of stone. Same thing right here. And then a window section. Right here. And that's it. <laughs> I just noticed it looks like a penis. A little bit. And balls and a penis. Shut up! <laughs> okay. So we got that done. We're going to raise our walls up to uh, four blocks high. So we're going to need to raise these up four blocks or actually we'll put them three on there because it already has one okay basically doing this for pretty much everything so I'm just going to fast forward this Okay, so we got all of the walls put up. Now, for the middle section of these walls, we're going to use cobblestone and we're going to put two on either side with a top row of stone bricks. And it's going to look like that. And that's going to be the same pattern for all the walls on the bottom level. It's going to change when we go to the top because we're going to have uh, wool on that. But um, the reason we're going to do this is basically it. I, I want to use the cobblestone and the stone bricks to make this look a bit d defensive I guess something that you could uh, maybe have the townspeople come in maybe the town's under attack or there's some kind of disaster going on and you need a refuge or a safe place for people to come and these fortified looking walls will help a lot with any problems you might have Whoops. Okay. I'm probably just gonna fast forward this, so I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, so now that we have that done, we're going to go in and put in some of the more, or not really detail work, but some of these aren't going to be windows and some of them are. So we need to come over here and grab this bad boy right here. Now some of this we aren't going to do quite yet, like the, uh, the supports right here or right here. We're going to save those for later. We're just doing the basics right now for this video, so we come over here. And put in this is a uh, what uh, light gray wool. 
So it looks different on John Smith's texture pack, but you know, I'll just let you know. There we go. That's not gonna be a window. That's not a window. Here, that's not a window. And that's not a window. So now that we have that done, let's move on to the. Uh, well, uh, we can move on to the second floor. I think we can. Don't see why not. Okay, so we're going to start off with the tower right here. And we're going to put in uh, log blocks in each of these corners. Like so. And this is going to go up, what, another four blocks? So, two, three, four. Okay, like so. And like I said before, this is to add... Um, some more depth to the tower so it's not straight up and down it has three levels and a top piece it just adds a bit more detail than having it uh, just plain and these walls are going to be slightly different as well so we need to put in stone bricks right here on the sides and cobblestone in the middle like so repeat it on this side there we go I'm actually gonna repeat it on all four sides so we'll take off a spot for uh, for a door later, but just want the walls to be the same. Okay, and we'll do the same thing for this tower. Oops. Okay, four corners. Whoa, okay. Make it four blocks high. There we go. And repeat the process. Okay, so we got that done. We're going to move on to this area, this part of the building. So, whoa, wait for things first. Sorry, totally forgot about these. Forgot to do this part. <laughs> okay. And these aren't going to be windows either, so just put in a light gray wool. Okay, so. This middle part of that is going to be slightly different. Not quite, really. Not. Well. Yeah. It is going to be different because we're going to have this uh, pushed in one block. So. <laughs> let's go do that. And this one's going to be four blocks high. So we need to put these at one, two, three, four. Four. There we go. Same thing for this. There we go. Okay, so for this um, part, we aren't going to have stone bricks on it. We're going to have cobblestone. And we're going to have cobblestone on the bottom and the top. You dig? You got it? Cool. Okay. <laughs> so three blocks and three blocks with the middle being light gray wool. And we'll repeat it right here. Okay, and this this is the pattern that we're gonna have for all of these windows and the third floor on top of this one. The reason we're not putting stone bricks up here, mainly because we already have some on the bottom, and plus it really makes sense. The stone bricks are really heavy. It's a really heavy material, so you wouldn't really put a whole lot higher up, and you're gonna have stone bricks more on the bottom, mainly because you don't want your building to come crashing down from the weight of the stone bricks. Now, I, I guess we can move on to a bit of the roof, possibly. Mm, yeah, I, I think we're good. Okay, so, <laughs> the roof right here is going to be cobblestone, I think, I don't, let me, let me check this. I did something different on these. I think it, sh yes, okay, okay, so we're going to have a pattern, like, and then, okay, cool. So we need to put light gray wool right here in these spots, and one right there, and then the rest, like so. We also need to bring these up by one block as well. Now we're going to take our oak wood stairs, and we're going to put some right here, 
right here and right here this will be your basic roof shape now you can keep it like this or you can add some flair to it like I did and have it come out like that and to do that is very easy you're just take your basic roof right here and you're gonna add a stair like that to make it look like a um it's going up so you have <laughs> two stairs three stairs four stairs and yeah that's about as good as I can explain it I don't know what else to say for that but anywho I'm gonna bring these around and we're going to put them on top of this tower like so we're not gonna connect them we're just gonna leave them like this and we'll bring these and they should meet up with the tower now the reason they're gonna wrap around the tower is mostly for aesthetics you know and they end it right there a little kinda awkward you know and I want it to look this building is supposed to look like it has a tower like, attached to it like, it's not separate uh, but more like a one big building kind of I really don't know <laughs> we'll build these across and like so I think <laughs> let me check uh, did I bring them around cover that up no I didn't okay never mind okay so we'll take uh, those two off and we'll build this across and we need we need oak wood slabs and we'll build our roof like this put slabs on the bottom this is to make the roof look a bit thicker but without adding upside down stairs I'm gonna do that and then for the horn part we're going to take off one two three four so up until you hit this tree block replace those with stone wood or not stone wood what am I talking about oak wood planks and put an upside down stair and then a regular stair on top of that and there you go that's your that's your roof this thing is going to repeat it for all the roofs in the entire building except for the towers so we'll go ahead and repeat this right here so oak wood light gray wool oak wood like so and stairs all the way across cover up the tower and now we're gonna step right here by the way because that's gonna be the start of that roof but yeah bring this across and out three blocks and this goes out four blocks and back okay and I'll just fast forward this part or just I'm just gonna skip it Okay, so that is your two front buildings already pretty much finished except for the additional touches and uh, in the next video or the next part we're going to move on to finishing up the towers, uh, finishing this entryway, actually we'll do, probably do that, maybe we'll have time, I don't know, <laughs> we'll have to wait and see, and we'll save this part for the last. So I will see you guys in the next video, thanks for watching, don't forget to leave a comment, rating, and subscribe, and uh, yeah. Nice watching.